Hey guys, welcome to another vlog. My name is Sarisha and um, today we're talking about something called propolis or propolis, um, whatever works for you. I say propolis. So the, the product that I'm using, and there's many different versions of this particular um, tincture, but I am using a tincture. There's creams and there's ointments and there's serums. Um, for me, I think that anything works best when it's sublingual or taken internally because it's helping to um, detoxify um, internally and then you see the outward benefits. So I, I stumbled across this online because I was looking for something for my eyes and um, if you look very closely, my eyes have a, a slight like yellow tinge to it and I've been trying to get rid of it for many years. It started when I started taking um, Roaccutane in my 20s and that was many, many years ago. And in my 20s, I found that after a few years, Roaccutane started to obviously either have an impact on my liver or kidney and my my eyes um, started to get that yellow tinge to it. So I've been trying to counter that ever since. And I was told that the um, eye tincture, or specifically for the eye area, is fabulous for um, getting rid of yellow or aging eyes. So I have ordered it, um, and I'm waiting for it to come in. I was stupid enough to put some of these in my eyes, which stung like a bee. Now, speaking of bees, um, this is basically where the tincture comes from. It comes from uh, plant resins and secretions from bees, and bees use this particular um, um, tincture or re release this or secrete this to um, to cover or to seal their hives as well as um, to use it as an antibacterial to clean because everything's so clean with bees and this is basically what it is. So in this tincture, I take it in uh, directly under my tongue. So two or three drops. I know, I know. It's like echinacea where... So basically straight un under the tongue. The first time you have it, you're going to die because it's like the most horrid tasting thing in the world. I've been taking it for three months now, so I've gotten used to it. Why do I love it so much? I, I feel that together with echinacea, it really um, has assisted in keeping me nice and healthy during the winter. Um, I also had a little bit of a boil coming up right here. So what I did was I literally drew the lip out and popped a few drops onto the boil and within a day it was gone. So not only is it working to anti-back, kill viruses, it helps with colds and flus, helps with eczema, psoriasis, there's a host of things it does. It really is brilliant um, in, in terms of treating ailments and I think that you know, having the winter that we're having in Durban right now, it would be really helpful to have this around. I will also give you an update as soon as I get um, the tincture for my eyes and um, I will let you know if it's worth a buy or not. But right now, this has also become a part of my daily routine and I hope you will add it to yours as well. As well, um, The one I'm using is by Phytoforce. I know there are many, many versions of it. So, you know, whatever works for you, but just make sure that it has the proper tinctures and serums in it. And I got it for 115 Rand. So nice and easy. Something that I would really love for you to try. Abrasions, wounds, eczema, psoriasis, colds and flus, everything. So um, I know that it also works for boils and a whole lot of hysterical things happening inside your body. Um, I would definitely try it. It's natural and natural is the way to go. Thanks for listening.